Hello gamers, this is Game Master 13000 and today I'm going to do a very special video that I found out quite a while ago. It is... this In this video I'm going to show you how to get Minecraft for free. It's not exactly Minecraft, more so a Minecraft alternative, but it still works pretty well as this original Minecraft. So what is it called is Mineshafter. No doubt you guys probably heard of that, but the thing is, there has been an update to a new site to Mineshafter, and it's pretty awesome. I've used it, but so yeah, this in this video I'm going to show you how to get it. Okay, so I'm already running something here. Just ignore that. Okay, now first thing I want to show you is that the new Mineshafter site is not compatible with Windows Explorer. So if you're going to go to this new Mineshafter site, then you're going to need to use either Google Chrome or Firefox. I know those two br web browsers work. Okay, so what you're going to first type in is mine shafter and click and just enter. Now, go to the mine shafter site. No doubt there's probably a No doubt there's probably a little box here showing you that there's a new site and just click the new site to go to it. Now I'll show you this is what happens when you go to the Mineshafter site on Windows Explorer. There's a whole black top up here and it's just it's not very good. It's just a whole black top and if you try to log in I'll show you what happens. It will keep redirecting you to the page you're on. As you can see, it was already on this page earlier. And if you go to the server list, if it loads, if I click log in again, it will redirect me to the server list. So you do not want to use you do not want to use Internet Explorer. I tested Google Chrome and Firefox, and they work fine. So if you have an Internet Explorer, you can't access the site. You should get another browser. Okay, so I'm going to use my Google Chrome now. If it will load up. Okay. Just waiting to load up. Okay, here we go. Okay, and I'm just going to wait for it to load. It's taking so long, I don't know why. Okay, hold on a bit. It's coming. Okay, well, I think it's going to stay like this. So just type in Mineshafter again. Or Mineshafter.info, I believe, will take you to the new site. I think that's... Yeah, here we go. Mineshafter.info will take you to the new site. As you can see, I'm already currently logged in. So I'm just going to log out. Okay, so this is if this is what it'll like if you log into Google Chrome and Firefox. So it'll look like this is not the whole black screen on the top, and it looks much better. So what you want to first do is you want to log in, or in this case, if you're still a new user, create an account. If you want to do, if you want to refer to anything about transferring your account to from your old Mindshafter account then that's something you should refer to this site. It has something to do with that. So when you click the login, it will lead you to this Mozilla Persona window. And if you're a new user, it will ask if you already have an account, you can either sign into the Persona using your email address, your password, and I believe somewhere around here, there should be a new user tab. Let's see, so I'm not gonna log in yet. Let's see, oh, it failed. So, okay, maybe, yeah, maybe I will log in. So once you register with Persona, it's pretty much the same thing if you're registering for anything else. I'm just gonna log in. I believe if you type it in the first time and you don't have an account, it'll it'll automatically have you register stuff for it. 
So, yeah. Okay, then type in your password. I'm not going to let you see this. So, I'm just going to pause. I'm just going to stop the video real quick and have me log in. Okay, I am back. And once you have logged in, just go to your. Okay, just go to downloads and download the Mineshafter proxy. Now, I recommend you save the Mineshafter proxy to your desktop because that is where you will log into your Minecraft account. And, yeah, so just log into your Minecraft account with the Minecraft proxy, and you also want to go to settings in here. Now, if you have connect to your Minecraft account, usually it would say right here. If you haven't already connected your account, because they're no longer c connecting you from your Minecraft account due to some random things with um, Mahjong changing its code login thing to email address, I don't really know, but... So, they're going to ask you here to create a username and in, and a, a uh, password for your account and that's what you will log in with now if you want to change your skin you're gonna to have to go to skin decks I already have a tab here so just type in skin decks in your search bar and you'll go to skin decks now just type in the skin just go to a skin you want if you're on home if you're on home just go to the skin you want and then it'll give you a URL link Um, I already gonna. I'm just gonna go back to that skin I had because I already had the skin uploaded. I already don't mind the background noise. Sorry. But. Okay, so this is my skin I've uploaded personally. If you want to upload a personal skin, you're going to have to create a mine, um, a skin next account, and then oh my cat meowing in the background. Okay, just. Go to if dang what was I saying? Uh, okay, so basically, if you want to upload a custom skin, you're going to have to load. You're going to have to create a, mo a skin decks account and then upload your skin from there. Perhaps in a future video, I'll show you how to do that, but it's pretty straightforward after that. Okay, so in here there will be the image link. Just just click that, and it should go blue like this. If it doesn't, just click hold down control, press A, and then once you have that done, you just click control C or X. Um, well, apparently not control X. Okay, so once you have that, just control V into this set, and you have your current skin uploaded right here. Here's the cloak URL. It'll basically be the same thing with a cloak account. Uh, now, I'm not going to show you how to do that because for me, it's a whole nother process. I think it'll be better explained in another video. So, yeah. Uh, I'm not going to show you the whole thing about cloaks yet. So, now, once you have that done, you have your skin changed, your username, your downloads. Yeah, that basically covers it. Oh, wait. But there's also the server list. Now, you can actually log into servers using Skindex. I mean, no, not Skindex. Mineshafter. Although, however, you have to use the Mineshafter servers. And I find most of my Mineshafter servers here. So, yeah. Now, I'm just going to minimize these. And I'm going to go to Mineshafter. The Mineshafter jar I have uploaded here. Loading for it to load up. Okay, here we go. Um, okay, that's my brother's account. Okay, so just once you're here, it basically looks like the Minecraft, the basic Minecraft login, and go to and just.
type in your username and password. Nelson and Okay, so yeah, login. It'll be like this for a little bit. Probably gonna lag because I'm recording, but just wait. Okay, I'm gonna pause the video real quick while I wait for it to load up. Oh, wait. Okay, look, it's loading up. Well, I'm still gonna pause the video because I gotta switch recording views. Okay, regrettably, because my computer is lagging up, and it, Minecraft froze and everything just went wrong. But I do guarantee you that this does work. And I do know why my computer is lacking because I'm downloading something right now. But I do guarantee you this works. And it's a, mo it's a pretty good alternative to the actual Minecraft. And you should check it out. Uh, in a future video I'll see if I can actually show you how to get cloak and maybe even start up a land world to play with your friends i don't know that seems to be tricky tackle that i don't know how to do yet but yeah so this is the end of the video and if, if you like this video please click that like button and please subscribe because i'm planning to do many more videos in the future and yeah this is game master 13,000 or gameland and i'll see you later <laughs>